Hi friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I am going to be sharing with you very beautiful and beginner friendly crochet chevron shawl pattern. You can make blankets with this pattern as well. Super easy to make. Any beginner can make this pattern very easily. In this video, I will show you how to make this pattern. So, for this crochet project, I am using this mandala style yarn cake having changing colors in it label is off because I have used this yarn to make three last rows for my shawl I have made my shawl already and now I will just show you how to make the chevron pattern for this crochet project I am using a 4.5 millimeter crochet hook you can use 5 millimeter crochet hook with this yarn as well if you want to make your work a little bit loose it is up to you but I am using 4.5 millimeter crochet hook so first of all make a slip knot then with the help of crochet hook start making chains make chain 1 chain 2 chain 3 chain 4 chain 5 chain 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 in this way we would make multiples of 10 plus 3 chains So I have made 30 chains to start the first row make chain 1, chain 2 and then chain 3 which will be counted as a double crochet wrap the yarn around the crochet hook go into this fourth ring of chain drop a loop we have three loops on our crochet hook pull the yarn through two loops first and then pull the yarn through other two loops to make double crochet stitch wrap the yarn again go into the next chain draw up a loop pull the yarn through two loops first and then pull the yarn through other two loops to make a double crochet go into the third chain make a double crochet stitch into it then go into the next one make a double crochet so we have a set of five double crochet stitches including first three chains here now skip two chains and we are going to work into the next chain make a double crochet stitch into the next chain double crochet two into the next one double crochet three into the next one and then double crochet four into the next chain so we have a set of four double crochet stitches here this is the leather part of our pattern now we would make upper part so make two chains for this purpose and make a double crochet into the very next chain this is one double crochet make double crochet two into the next chain then make double crochet three into the next one double crochet 4 into the next one now again we would make the lower part this one so we would skip two chains here and into the third chain we are going to make one double crochet one double crochet into the next chain one double crochet into the next chain and then one double crochet into this fourth chain we have four double crochet stitches and we are going to make upper part now so we would make chain two and then we are going to make double crochet into the very next chain this is double crochet one double crochet two into the next chain 
then make double crochet 3 and then double crochet 4 again we are going to make the lower part skip 2 chains go into the third one and make a double crochet stitch into it we have 3 chains left now make a double crochet into the next chain make a double crochet into the second last chain then make a double crochet into the last chain we have a set of four double crochet stitches here but in the start here including first three chains we have five set of double crochet stitches so in this last chain we are going to make another double crochet stitch so we have a set of five double crochet stitches on both ends make chain one chain two and then chain three which will be counted as a double crochet and then turn up the work into the very first stitch right here we are going to start our work so in this same stitch make one double crochet then make one double crochet into the second stitch one double crochet into the third stitch and then one double crochet into the fourth stitch we have a set of five double crochet stitches including three chains here also and now we are going to skip next two stitches and then into the third stitch make one double crochet make one double crochet into the next stitch one double crochet into the next one and after that one double crochet in this chain two space again for the upper corner we are going to make chain two then a one double crochet stitch in this chain two space then we are going to make double crochets in these next three stitches one double crochet in the first one one double crochet into the second one and then one double crochet into the third one again we are going to skip these two stitches for the lower part then make a double crochet into the third stitch double crochet into the fourth one double crochet into the fifth one again we have chain 2 space double crochet 1 chain 2 and double crochet 1 in this chain 2 space so this is our pattern repeat it till the end and in the end we have chain 3 which is also counted as a stitch so in this third chain make double crochet 1 and then double crochet 2 and we have a set of 5 double crochet stitches here make chain 1 chain 2 and then chain 3 turn up the work start working from the very first stitch make double crochet into it make double crochet into the second stitch double crochet into the third stitch and double crochet into the fourth stitch skip two stitches go into the third one make one double crochet make one double crochet into the next one and then into the next one into the chain 2 space make double crochet 1 chain 2 and double crochet 1 so this is our pattern just repeat this row as long as you want your project to be I have made 
adult medium size shawl you can make adult large or any other size as well so i hope you guys like this beginner friendly tutorial video you can use it for blankets as well by just adding multiple of 10 chains in the base chain so give this video a big thumbs up if you like don't forget to subscribe to get more videos thank you so much for watching take care bye